Uh, Minneapolis Staple is closed tonight after a bus slammed through its walls. A U of M commuter shuttle crashed into the Acadia this afternoon. Somehow, no one was hurt. WCCO's Jennifer Merrily found out what it was like for the few people who were inside. A crowd gathered near Cedar and Riverside in Minneapolis's West Bank. Loud, bah, I don't know, loud for sure. After a University of Minnesota campus bus crashed into Acadia during the lunch hour. I just saw the bus go into it, really. It's taking a right right there, and I, I don't know if it caught the curb or whatever, but then it just went yeah, right into Acadia. The general manager of the restaurant and music venue said a line cook and bartender were the only ones inside. And he called and he said, hey, there's a bus in the lobby. No one was hurt, which is a miracle. It went right through our coffee bar, right through the cash register. We're told one passenger was on board along with the driver and another vehicle was involved with no injuries reported. The building suffered the blow. The bus going right through the glass, plowing down tables. People working upstairs said it felt like an earthquake. They were evacuated. Engineers and inspectors surveying the damage. They're trying to determine kind of uh, how much of a danger there is people being in the building. The crash became the talk of campus. I saw it on uh, Instagram today. With students concerned for the cafe and rider safety. I was just a little freaked out because that's the bus that I usually take when I'm getting around campus. So it's scary that it could happen. The businesses tell us the plan is to shore up the building, but it will probably be Friday before they're able to get a look inside. In Minneapolis, Jennifer Merrily, WCCO 4 News. The crash is under investigation. Acadia set up a fundraiser to help pay staff while it's closed.